Today we're learning how to instantly change all of the colors in your PowerPoint presentation. That means including all the shapes, the text, the icons, everything can change in one simple click. Now to save you guys some time, we'll look at instantly changing the colors of your presentation, creating a custom color palette, and I'll share the best color palette trick that will save you a lot of time, so stick around till the end. Changing colors, how to change the theme colors. In PowerPoint, when you select a color, you have this overview of different colors and you have a standard one or you can pick your own. And you do this by going to the design tab on the top left and then on the right, you will see variants. And if you click that drop down menu, you get the option to choose different color palettes for your presentation. And if you go to green, this instantly changes your entire presentation, depending on the colors that you've set up. If you select another color, for example, blue, this will turn your entire presentation blue. The nice thing is, if we go to preview mode on our presentation, everything remains the same. So we can still keep the animations that we had in the presentation. You can also see that the text or the numbers and the icons have changed according to the color that we've selected. How to customize this color palette? That's a crucial question. Let's say we find a nice color palette on the internet. This could be a screenshot. Then you go to the variant tab, colors, and at the bottom you have customized colors. You select that and this gives you a pop-up window. Here you can see different accent colors, so six accent colors, which are represented on a little preview mode on a graph. We also have a text and background colors, which are also represented. And then at the bottom we have a hyperlink and a followed hyperlink. Now these represent the colors from our color theme, so if we want to change them, we select a accent color, for example accent 5, and check the color picker and drag it on your picture that you've selected. Do the same for the different accent colors. I tend to keep accent color 6 in yellow because it's a color that goes well with most of the color palettes that I have. So I try to stick to that one. For the background and the text, we usually use black and white somewhere in the presentation, so I keep that one. Let's name it red pink, save, and this instantly changes our entire presentation to our red pinkish color scheme. And also if we preview it here, everything remains the way it was. This is pretty cool, but what saves us a lot of time? Well, it's our color palette tip and how to avoid manual recoloring. If we go for one of the standard colors, so let's take for example the office one, you can see the colors are very sharp and they contrast quite a lot. So depending on your style, this won't always work. Customizing this to your own color works will probably take a lot of time because you have to select individual objects and make sure that they align. We'll go through a few and you can see none of them look very clean to begin with. So I don't really like the standard color palettes. If you look at the custom ones, you can see they are more balanced and they're a lot easier on the eye. The purple one, the blue one, and also even the green one, they're, they remain in the same style. So what is the secret trick here? And if you go to the color palette, you can see that these color palettes have the same setup. We go from dark on the right to the left, which is a lighter tint of that color. Same with the green, same with the purple, same with the blue, and same with the red. So these are the accent colors that we've set up. So what you want to do is you want to make sure that the accent colors that you've used, you always go from dark to light. And that way, if you select a different color scheme, a color palette, all of the colors in your presentation remain the same. And you generally have darker colors for the background and lighter colors for the accent colors. So that way, if you stick to a consistent way of doing this, your presentations can easily be modified and you can always change your colors. Now, if you want to make this presentation yourself with the animated slides, you can find the tutorial here on the screen. Make sure to watch it and blow away your audience today. Thanks a lot for watching and hope to see you in the next video.